I would have him fire the puck, and then I would show him how everybody goes after the puck. Now watch. I'm going to go where it's going to be, not where it's been. So he'd fired along there, and I'd cut across, and I'd be right there where it was going to be. So you can teach anticipation. The lessons that Wally taught Wayne, I think really were ingrained in Wayne's consciousness. And because of it, Wayne has held himself with such esteem and class. He never wanted to let his parents down. Pure talent and desire lifted the prodigy to organized hockey at the age of six. From there, it was a short leap to full coast-to-coast -coast fame. He lived a life like none of us can imagine. He could skate before he could walk. And he became this sort of human icon in, in Canada. At 10 years old, he was swamped by other 10-year-olds for autographs. By 13, he was on National Hockey Night in Canada. So he's grown up sort of like John F. Kennedy Jr. He's been the Prince of Canada.